Twelve-year-old Vatana is a big fan of CBN's reimagined version of Superbook. And the Bible stories are changing his life and the lives of his friends. I think the Superbook program is really cool. I now trust and believe that God can do anything. Vatana's adventure with Superbook actually began two years ago with CBN's classic edition of the cartoon. He'd been struggling in school because of his sinus allergies. The medicine he took to treat them made him very sleepy. I get headaches and a stuffy nose. Sometimes I fall asleep on my desk and my classmates laugh at me. Vitana had taken antihistamines for seven years and it looked like he might have to take them for the rest of his life. I tried to stop taking my medicine, but my allergies got worse. When I thought about having allergies for the rest of my life, I felt sad and hopeless. Then a teacher invited Vitana to an after-school event to watch CBN's classic edition of Superbook, which had been translated into his language. I watched the story of how God saved his people from Egypt and brought them to the Promised Land. It was really good. I was excited to see the great things that God did. At the end of the Superbook program, Vitana's teacher shared the gospel and invited the children to receive Jesus as Savior. That day, as Vatana prayed to become a Christian, he asked God for something else. I pray that God would heal me of my allergies. I believe that he would answer my prayer. Vatana stopped taking his antihistamines and prayed every day until one morning he realized something had changed. I slept really well that night, and the next day, my allergies were gone. I could breathe through my nose. My mom and I were so happy. It's now been two years since Vatana has had any allergy symptoms, and he no longer struggles to stay awake in class. He loves watching the new Superbook and has been attending church with his new Christian friends. Superbook told me about God and that we can trust Him. God answered my prayers and healed me from my allergies. He can do anything.